up you guys, it's Megan and today is a good day because we are going on a cruise. My very first cruise ever. I'm so excited, it's like a Christmas cruise. Zach and his family usually celebrate Christmas but this year they decided instead of a lot of presents, they're gonna go on a cruise and I was invited along. So we're gonna see how it goes, if it's gonna be amazing. I hope it's gonna be amazing. We just took the dogs to my parents' house, now we are about to travel down to Galveston um, where we will take off and travel through like uh, cities in Mexico. I think we're gonna go to Cozumel and a few other places, so it should be fun. We're currently in Galveston, this is where we're taking off from. This is actually the city that Zach and I met at, so it's really exciting to be back here. And I think we're gonna go to downtown Galveston because I think that's where the ships take off. So I'm really excited, but I'm also not gonna have internet for like a week. That is gonna be tough. No Twitter, no Instagram, no, no. Snapchat, no Facebook. If my channel gets deleted while I'm gone, I just won't know about it. See, this is Galveston. I've been here many, many times and it's always really pretty. But whenever you get in the water, it's kinda yucky. But it looks nice. We made it to our cruise ship, or our room at least. Here's the room, you guys can kinda see it. It's really cozy and cute. So it should be a really good time. We have a lot of things planned. There's like a lot of comedy club things, like some wine tastings, um, some bingo games, and there, there's, there's a like, lot. There's like clubbing, there's like clubbing, shops, shopping, there's theaters, there's, theaters, plays, drive -in there's theaters. There's like movies, yeah. there's so much. Buffets, casinos. Ooh. It's gotta be a good time. Whoop whoop. But our luggage still isn't here. We've been here for like four hours, so. There's a little person waving down there. Bye, yeah. little person. Bye. I'm There's a dolphin. I don't. You just, you're lying. No, seriously. There it is. There it is. There it is. <laughs> There's a dolphin. There's a dolphin in the water. There he is. There he is. Yep. How's the drink? It's delicious. How's your life? It's amazing. I have a beautiful woman in it. Ah. <laughs> okay, guys. So we've officially set sail. We're on the balcony right now. We're about to go explore some amenities that the ship has. And then look at our view. It's beautiful. awesome. It's so pretty. So it's been a pretty eventful day on our first day of the cruise. We ate, we toured the entire place, we went to the casino and Zach lost money. Hey, don't mention that. No. <laughs> um, and now we're watching like a welcome aboard show. Why does this look so zoomed in? Is this it zoomed in? It's zoomed in. Oh, it's zoomed in. Hello. I'm good. Love Shack, Love Shack baby. baby. Uh, on the cruise, we just woke up, we ate breakfast, we sat outside uh, on our balcony for a bit and watched the ocean move. It was really cool. What are we doing today, Zach? I don't know. Yeah, you just said he didn't know. So we're in the lobby, we're about to play a game of Trivial Pursuit uh, with me, Zach, oh. Zach's mom, Dawn, oh, and Tyson. And I don't think we're gonna win because we don't, like, I don't know if we know too much trivia. Oh, we know trivia. Zach thinks we know trivia. But we also, we booked um, some excursions for whenever we go on shore tomorrow. We're gonna be doing a dolphin thing. Dolphin swimming. So it should be so much fun, but I'm gonna let you guys know how this Trivial Pursuit goes. Hopefully we win something, because they said there was prizes. All right, one more chance, Zach. Are we gonna win Trivial Pursuit? God, I hope so. What do we win? I don't even care, I just want something. So we lost the tiebreaker for a Trivial Pursuit, and it was really tough and scary. Zach filmed it in his vlog. So if you wanna see it, go there, because I had to go up and I was a part of the thing. But we got a participation medal, so that's cool. We took second. We got second, second place. place. Good. Not, great. not too bad. All the free ice cream we could ever eat. That's a lot. <laughs> we just bought some stuff from some super sale. Stupid. It was, we got it a bag. was silly, but we got a bag for whenever we go to the beach tomorrow. And look at this ocean. The ocean is so big and it scary is. and dark and fast. Oh, did you guys just see that alien thing? Oh no, we missed off? it. Oh, there's Tarzan. Tarzan. What are you doing in the ocean? So we finally made it 
Cosmo, Mexico. <laughs> I think I'm already sick. But the water is super blue and it's really warm here, which is nice because it's the middle of December, but you don't even need a long sleeve t-shirt. And Megan's gorgeous. Aww. I'm just gonna upload this to my vlog. I'm gonna vlog you vlogging and that's gonna be my vlog. And then they can come watch the substance on my vlog. <laughs> Unless they really do yeah. like it. Ooh. <laughs> you ready for Mexico, babe? You know it. Got the hat, got the bag, got the camera, got the fanny pack. And the flip flops. Flip flops. You're ready. You guys ready to swim with the dolphins? Oh yeah, you know it. Um, How do you feel? Yes, I'm all excited. I'm gonna fall in love with a dolphin. <laughs> oh, gross. <laughs> The dolphin experience. It was fun. You you pet the dolphins. I did. It was, I pet him. I kissed him. Yay! I danced with him. I know. I hugged him. We tried to take a picture together, but they said that they wouldn't let us because no. it like scares the dolphins to have two people near. <laughs> Megan's pretty scary. <laughs> I'm I'm not. But now we're gonna eat. We just bought the footage, so we're gonna insert that. I think it's probably before though. Mm. You can see it right now. So we've come back to the shopping center uh, to do some shopping and pick up some gifts I got for my parents and my sister, right? Ooh, secrets and surprises. Yeah, Zach got to dance with the mariachi band. It was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> hey, babe. What'd you get? I got steak tacos and queso. Yay! Do you do a lot of shopping? Not really. I watched a lot of shopping happen. <laughs> shot, 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 shot. What is that, babe? It's a jello shot. It looks I like watermelon. It's actually just jello watermelon. Does it taste like watermelon? Yeah, it's not bad. <laughs> it's a new day and we finally made it to Progreso, Mexico. I it's think that's what it's called. Progreso? Progreso. In the Yucatan. Like the soup. Like the like the soup. Um Today, we are gonna go look at some Mayan ruins. We are gonna have a beach day and it's gonna be awesome. And if you look down at the water, a whale just pooped. That's actually just sand. Don't listen to Zach. <laughs> or a whale poop. Or a whale poop. But there's a lot of seagulls and the water's really blue. So I'm really excited for the beach part and I guess the Mayan part, but I don't I don't wanna get too exhausted. I like onions. We made it to the ancient Mayan ruins and they are awesome. Mm -hmm. I studied this stuff in art history a couple semesters ago and I always thought it was really cool so it's finally awesome to be able to see one in real life. And touch it. And touch it and stand on it, which kind of feels a little disrespectful, yeah. <laughs> but like for example, this is an ancient, uh, it used to be sacred sinkhole uh, in the palace or in the area, where is it? In the town that was in the center yep. of the town and only royalty was able to use it to connect to the underworld for their ancestors, but now everybody gets one minute. 
Even this lady. Floating. Probably not royalty. Probably not. Probably not. But this is where they did um, offerings and gifts and maybe sacrifices, human sacrifices. Oh yeah, offerings, that sounds like sacrifices to me. In our history, I learned that the Mayans actually did a lot of blood sacrifice and bloodletting where they would cut themselves and put their blood on paper and then burn the paper and send it to the gods. If the blood touched the ground, then it was considered unholy. So they would bleed onto a piece of paper, burn that, so it would go up to the gods. And that's how they did a lot of their blood sacrifices. Serious. Huh. We can't actually go inside the building. They have it gated off, which makes sense because they probably don't want a bunch of, yeah, tourists walking in there. What are you saying? Give me my fans real history. What's the real history of the ruins? SpongeBob took down Sandy Cheeks here in the Battle of Bikini Bottom. Or did the Spanish conquistadors recover the city after the Mayans know, fled? That more like an interesting Nickelodeon show. Nah. Uh, not not this. <laughs> you gonna climb the temple? I'll climb that temple. I'm waiting for the picture first because I'm not trying to climb this temple for four minutes. <laughs> it's gonna be a trek. My butt hurts. I'm cramping. I haven't had enough water on this trip. You ready? They're doing a lot of construction here, which really takes us out of the out of the magic of it all. And all the tourists too. I guess we're one of them. Yeah. <laughs> so we really can't complain. Nope. Zach, what's this Mayan ruin? That is an ancient Parula gold mine temple. Gold mine temple. Looks it's pretty good. We're about to drive into a storm. Dun, dun, dun. That's heavy rain. Look at that way. Yeah. Oh, it's windy. 